This video will show you how to use AirPlay to display what is showing on your iPad up to a smart board using either Reflector, which is a program that runs on a wireless computer like a laptop, or an Apple TV. The ability to do this is built in to Apple iOS devices. So iPod Touches, iPhones, iPads can all do this. In iOS 7, you swipe up from the bottom of the screen and this opens the control center. Right here where it says SCNB M Granger 1, if I wasn't connected, it would say AirPlay. And it would have an icon of a rectangle with an arrow coming out of it. When I tap on that, it's going to bring up all of the devices that are within range of this wireless network. The iPad is on the wireless network, the computer is on the wireless network, so I would just tap my computer and then tap the mirroring so it turns green. Then it shows up. It's mirroring what's on my iPad on my computer now. And if the computer is connected to the projector, then it's showing up on the smart board. If I tap anywhere else on the screen that goes away, I can tap again and the control center goes away. Whatever's on my iPad I can open up and now we can interact with this so the students can see it. We can pass it around so students can take turns. You have to remember that what's happening is you are mirroring what is on your iPad to the computer and then through the computer connected to the projector up on the board. So just like looking in a mirror, it's a reflection of what's on the iPad. You can't look in a mirror and comb the hair on the mirror and do anything to the real hair. You can't touch the board to do anything to the iPad because the board is just a reflection of what's on the iPad. To turn off AirPlay, you swipe up from the bottom again, tap to whichever device you're connected to, and then simply tap iPad. And then the signal will stop showing on the computer through the projector onto the board, and it will just show up on the iPad. You don't have to turn off mirroring because then you'll just have to turn it back on next time. If you leave it on and just go to iPad, then the next time you select that device, it will mirror automatically. You won't have to turn mirroring on every time. So again, to turn it off, just tap again on iPad. When you do that, Reflector is still running on the computer, so at any time, you can swipe up again, open up your control center, tap on the AirPlay again, select your device, and it's back on. Now, Reflector has to be started every day. Every time you restart the computer, you'll have to go and start Reflector. It doesn't load automatically. So that is how the AirPlay, so you can mirror what's on your iPad to a smart board.